So here in Vienne, that's V-I-E-N-N-E, -N -N -E, the Knights Templars were disbanded in 1312, exactly at, in this cathedral. Oh, I look Swissy. Hello, what are you doing here? Hey. I'm terribly sorry, it's in the night. I would have done it in the daytime, but I'm tired. I don't want to come back here because it's a town south of uh, Lyon. And I wouldn't know where to sleep here, so I want to walk and I, I want to leave this place so I can sleep somewhere on the countryside. So let's have a look if it's open. It's a cathedral, enormous. So here it says the Cathedral of, uh, in Vienne. This is the name of the town. Here it says in English, but it doesn't say anything about the Knights Templars. But, well, anyway. So right, right next to the cathedral, there's the uh, Rue des Templiers, the Road of the Knights Templars. Let's have a look. It's probably nothing to see anymore. So here it says Rue des Templiers, Rue du Temple. So the Freemasons are here. There's, there's no doubt. You know. The only thing I see here is this little. Oh, well, whatever. I don't know what that is. Yes. No, I can't really tell you what that is. Let's have a look. I was also uh, La Rue de Jacques de Molay. So here, Rue de Jacques de Molay. And uh, maybe it's here. Free ma uh, Freemason stuff here. Looks like it actually. Here's the uh, Le Rhone. Big river. I'm quite lost here in the middle of the night here. Eh? Or in the beginning of the evening. Uh, I have to do a lot of walking. I missed the last petrol station actually. Big river. So, yeah, let's have a look. Oh, look at this. Uh, shit. Pyramid. Fold out pyramid. Wow. And, uh, Here in Brex. Oh, this is new, some wannabe Templars, you know, it's still existing, eh? Next to that door and this here. Square and compass, sort of. Uh, anybody here? Oh, a little pyramid, and behind it is the real one. Let's go and have a look, La Pyramide de Lille. So this is really incredible, they call it the La Pyramide de Lille, I-S-L-E. And a guy, he just told me, the Romans, they, do, they used to do wagon uh, runnings, you know, like um, who was the fastest. And they went around this thing, and there was another one somewhere, they don't know it anymore. So this thing is like 2,500 years old or something. Roman next to the Rhone River so you know they were all next to these next to these big rivers uh, very important so this is a Roman pyramid amazing there's probably a sign somewhere very very old so it's interesting I mean I'm quite lost here but um, I'm discovering a lot of things here you know, See if we can find a shield. So here it says in English and here in German what they were doing here. And here you can see like the picture here, like here. Uh -huh. So they like like Daytona or what do you call it? Like you know, like in America, you know, like it's just going around and around and around. There was so there was one one of these things at one side there, and there was one on the other side. Uh, and this is a, uh, it's not a, it's a gravure, a gravure from 1780 of this thing. So they already painted it and all that, and this is what it looked like. A course de char, you know, like, hey, hey, you know, like, now they do it with the V8. Then they had eight horses, like, yeah. So one on each side, eh? And they were running around with these, uh, 
you know, with these wagons and the horses and uh, oi, oi, imagine. So this is very, very old. It's a bit older than the Templars Castle, boys. <laughs> yeah. And probably the winner, you could you like drive through it or something, like the uh, Lac de Triomphe. Amazing. Okay, but, uh, well, they're the same ones, it's all pharaoh. These ones, pharaohs with the pyramid here or obelisk. Templars are pharaohs, they're all pharaohs, you know, like. <laughs> and another place for the tent. I know what kind of trees it is. It's a place called uh, Lardèche. Fantastic, beautiful. Wee, what kind of a cross is this? Double cross. So this is apparently this is also the Rhone. I'm going to visit a fan of my videos here. Wow, it's such a beautiful country. It's amazing. Oh man. I think this is the most beautiful country in the world, I tell you. Don't go and see the bloody Eiffel Tower, forget about that. Huh? 